this year. Released 12, oh, no, that's not right. But 11, 11, yeah, it's been 11. Because I think that I released 10 new ones, like one a month, and then I think there's one that was a compilation album. So depending on where you check out the music, uh, yeah, but like at least 10 or 11, depending on how you, if you go to on YouTube, there's going to be, I think, 11, I, I think. So like one a month and I'm going, oh my gosh, that's a crazy number of albums, but it, it kind of needed to come out and needs to happen. And I think, I don't know how, how the music's going to evolve at this point. Like, I just literally don't know. Which is, and I'm okay, like, I'm okay with that. It's like, it's a good place to be because I've done this and it's four years now so there's this nice um amount of music that you guys can enjoy and i think what i'm really looking for i've got this really crazy notion that somehow and i think it might happen i hope it does that and uh, maybe by talking about it will happen even faster that um maybe we'll have a library of sounds that ai will be able to give us like little beats that we and i know there are tons of beats out there i don't so i'm not referring to that i'm talking to like an actual like a like a program like if those of you in the know when you use it like a daw like there'd be something that'll be introduced where it's you've got session players that are really jamming which we have now because that's just amazing and you could have like beats that are actually maybe from some of the best songs, whatever best is, is you know, I mean, all music is beautiful. Like there might be some, some and AI will know how to just like pluck some of the, the beats that are just really resonating that, that tighten our DNA. You know what I'm talking about. And I think that what, what will happen is that if I'm, and I'm envisioning like, I don't know, 20,000 new beats or something like that. And we can just go in and compile and make new music and new sounds. And so if you're, if you're an artist that allows, you know, your music to be downloaded and to be able to be reprogrammed into new sounds, that's, I think, a good thing because that's like, that's how we get the, the new sounds in the music. Then it's going to be really interesting because this has been, that's why we're doing it, right? To get new sounds. So it's going to be, we're looking at... I don't know what the time frame could be, but it could be as I could be early. It could be like in 2025. Who knows? So I think that I'm gonna probably just kind of watch and see what happens, and because um, you can you can make only so many iterations of your own sounds, and then you have to like take a break, get new stuff going. But anyway, the new album that's out, I think it's like like I said, the 12th, 11th album this year, is in one this year is called. Um, wonderland what is it called <laughs> wonderland wonderland stories for bedtime slumber and i thought it, a, a lot of the music on this album is very relaxing and very like like kind of put you to sleep in a really mellow like oh healing just feeling really good kind of way with the exception of um adrenaline <clears throat> that's i don't know that guy ended up on the album and it's very much an outlier and it's def definitely like caffeinated it has kind of like a country rock sound, I guess. And there might be another one to uh, Jacob's Journey is a bit, you know, so you just have to check it out and see. But it's like, and I love the one called Everyone because it's for everyone. And, um, and so having said that, check it out and enjoy. Love you guys. Bye.